two months premature, and a heart condition. One might say I was born to overcome challenges. I searched for my place in this world, and I found it here. This pebble dice is where I battle now. I have my sights set on the Olympics, and I will push hard to get there. Yeah, we came out this morning with a lot of energy and uh, won the hammer and made it count early and then uh, you know, did the, the classic curling. Get two when you have the hammer and make sure you don't give up deuces. Were you looking around, scoreboard tracking at all, or do you just kind of focus on what's going on in front of you because that's all you can control? Yeah, no, I mean, I'm focusing on what's going on. I think every now and again, I think Ty was giving me updates of the Finland-Canada game over there. But uh, um, all we can do is just win our two and, and you know, hopefully we don't end up in that tiebreaker scenario where you're straight out without playing a game. What did you like about what the guys did in front of you today? Um, everything. <laughs> no. We, uh, you know, we positioned rocks well, and uh, when, when we needed to make a shot, no matter who was playing it today, um, we came up with some really nice ones. Um, just got to stay sharp. We've, uh, we've came out extremely sharp the last, I think, the whole second half of the week here, and, and not to have any let down and come out here and play hard. Yeah, yeah, we started off really well, and we had full control, and then uh, my last rock in the 9-10 picked, so I gave him three instead of an easy hit for two, but uh, we were still one up with the hammer coming home, so I guess we are still big favorites then, so we managed to pull it off. Right. That's a good team, though. I, I, I don't. Th people, that's the Japanese program. Obviously, has gotten better. You saw them last year. Yeah. What did you like about what you saw from them? Yeah, I, I really. I, they because we we played some really good ends and managed to get a lead there. But uh, they they play some good curling. They're going to be around. Yeah. You were watching the Canadian tenth end, and uh, <laughs> that was intense. That was intense. Yeah, and uh, Canada managed to pull it off. But that was a close game as well. As long as we keep on winning, I'm happy with the guys. And uh, we are a bit up and down today, but uh, struggling a bit with the ice at the end there. It's been soft in the middle there, but uh, still happy all over. Yeah. That routine, eh? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Far from, that's for sure. What What was going on out there? Just tough, you know, tough. Uh, that's, uh, we played with those, those stones uh, against the U.S. and kind of had the same sort of battle. Uh, and uh, yeah, you know, just again, variables, different variables. We're trying to get it all figured out. And, uh, you know, we weren't real sharp uh, as far as the rock positioning part of it. But uh, hung in there. You know what? I'm not going to focus on that. We hung in there and battled and uh, found a way to win. Does pulling out a win give any kind of satisfaction in a circumstance like that? Oh, for sure. 100%. Uh, you feel a lot better, uh, as always, when you win, you know, versus the other uh, options. So, uh, yeah, no, we're done on that sheet now. We, uh, you know, we, we found a way to grind out a couple wins on that one and uh, that was good. Carter that was a bit more of a grind than you might have expected obviously a good curling team but uh, uh, well, actually they I would say there's about three shots that the uh, skipper made that made the difference for them they they would have they would have beat us basically. Right. What was the comfort level like for you guys out there? Uh, just about zero uh, every time we we guess one way and we were wrong we guessed the other way wrong and not sure if it was us or the ice or the rocks but we just couldn't couldn't get it figured out. With that in mind, to actually get a win under those circumstances says something about the team, doesn't it? Yeah, we don't. We're not gonna. We're not gonna quit. We're never gonna quit. But it was just just disappointing that we couldn't get it figured out because that was the second time we were on our on third time on that sheet, I think, and we we're not uh, we're not doing the process right or figuring things out right. On the upside, you don't have to go back there. Yes, that was the, that's the only good news that come out of this. 